y'all. So y'all, today I was gonna start with my air signs, um, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. And I pulled the cards already, but I was getting a download, so I want to get this message out. Um, and it kind of resonate with what the cards that I pulled for y'all is. Um, it's like a energy of somebody or people wanting to say, um, either to you or maybe some of the air signs are feeling like this towards somebody else. It's, it's not you that I don't give a F about. It's your ego I don't give a F about. So I want to say, y'all, it's one thing to be uh, self-assured, be confident, like have self-confidence and stuff. But if it, um, if it causes you to like make somebody else feel less than or low, like you building yourself, you but tearing somebody else down in the process, like comparing your life like comparing your life your home your kids your car your finances your you know what i'm saying like if you have to like oh no i, I can't do that or oh mine like this i can't settle for that or oh she i can't deal with her she like this or oh no you got to do it like this or that you can't dress like that oh i i wear this that that's too cheap or if all of those things are is how you are how you that's arrogance that's selfishness so that's acting out of ego that's not you know what i'm saying because true self-growth you know if if whoever doesn't know is acting truly out of the pureness of your heart through love you know what i'm saying through good intent and love and i know like that does not mean we have to treat everybody like even the ones that we feel you know don't don't uh, necessarily deserve our um, energy if you're positive and, and you you like I can't deal with all these negative people okay that's different you you should be able to discern who you need to set boundaries with you know what I'm saying and that's another way to to um uh, for self-improvement is it's setting boundaries with the people that you know in your heart does not um don't bring positive changes into your life don't bring harmony to your life don't bring balance to your life don't bring peace to your life okay but for you to to um be happy with yourself if it if it calls for tearing somebody else down you still have healing to do they still have healing to do because a true star and this came out in the reading this aquarius the star doesn't have to be selfish to show their worth doesn't have to be uh arrogant the star in itself exudes all, all the the um the purest energies, like all the purest energies, and y'all have this in y'all reading air signs. So you exude this alone if you tap into it. You know y'all could be dealing with other Aquarius, or you know it's just like you so connected, and it's like you gotta use that to your advantage. But tearing people down is not a step ahead. That's a step still that's a standstill you know what i'm saying um you don't you don't grow having to compare or test somebody else down or even be so arrogant to the point where it's like people are forming resentment for you it's not like your advice is being taken in because you 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 come across with love and good intent somebody who has to test somebody down out of selfishness and arrogance is is only creating resentment from others and hate you know what I'm saying? And that, so it's just like, and then it's, it's the magician. The magician is like, y'all don't even know how, how strong of a manifest, a manifestor y'all are. Um, people don't know, like, manifesting can be done unintentional. It's a lot of people that manifest, don't even know what manifesting is all about. It's just really setting the intention and really imagining what you want your life to be like and always thinking those thoughts and feeding yourself with positive thoughts and um imagining that how you want yourself how you want your future to look and every day you thinking that same thought until it becomes reality so people do that and not even realize it but y'all have this gift of manifestation so if you set your intention and really focus on that y'all don't even understand how much y'all like you can turn your entire life around you know what I'm saying? With a simple change of mindset. There's so much good luck here. Like, it's just so much. And y'all have everything 
in the grass that you need to be successful in anything career love every part of your life but you got to get out of these energies where you fighting for attention or somebody fighting you for attention but you entertaining it and you in this queen of stars this is air sign where you like just being kind of like um it's an intelligent uh person but it's kind of like a bitter way it's it's almost like not acting out of love it's like separate from your emotions so you're dealing with it through logic and um it's just a fierce side of yourself it's it's um being almost cold hard but just acting off of facts not emotion it's not it's non-biased energy it's just like this what it is you this how i gotta act but y'all gotta understand when the universe send you something like it ain't gonna be this confused and ain't gonna be this difficult it ain't gonna be this much fighting like all these people well first of all you're not even gonna be thrown in all these different crosses look like and entertaining lower entities it's like when you if you have all this confidence and you know all this okay well you have to you have to set your life accordingly you know what I'm saying? If you still entertaining dramarous people, dramarous relationships, still want to hear what somebody feeling and all this and that, okay, well, don't be confused and don't wonder why you still stuck with the, like, not wanting to decide on things because you're not clear-headed. It's like once you're clear and you your energy is truly um, grounded, that is when you know that you're tapping in and you, you become you becoming a like woken up you know what i'm saying because it's like we all go through that you know dealing with petty stuff like but when you really want your energy to change and want your life to change and want true happiness like you're gonna stop the bs like nobody deserves especially with all this good stuff looking up y'all got the world card this is really like it invites you to to reflection over your journey and honor your achievements and tune into your spiritual lessons bask in the joy of bringing your goals to fruition all the trials and tribulations along your path have made you into the strong person you are today but this is like closing loose ends on stuff this could mean marriage but you have to drop baggage you know what i'm saying when something not serving you and you still hold on to it i know a lot of us it's hard to let go of things but in order for growth and true um blessings and and true spiritual rewards like we have to let go that's why we have the death card here where it's things that's ending but it's ending is good change is good because it it's it's it allows us to build things on a more solid foundation things that in need to end you have to let it go you know what i'm saying and it's like something happened like maybe that last straw thing and it's like y'all really feeling like okay because but spirit is saying just take that leap like you're going to you're not gonna fall and die like you but it could have been a real death in somebody's family like where they you know like spirit is saying like this is a new cycle like you know like if you just see through it as a good thing like and see the good in all the negative things that you've gone through and just release it and be open to this transformation and so what's on the other side like i swear that's like that is true fulfillment like period like you know what i'm saying eternal peace like just peace of mind like you 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 know so you already trusting that you are you connected and you guided and you support it so what is there to fear what is there you know what i'm saying no weapons formed against you shall prosper it will not prosper but you have to know that and believe that you know what i'm saying like that's it y'all i love y'all that's what i have until next time.